A group of high school students are exploring a potential career path where workers are in demand. Tonight, News 8 Cedar Sanchez tells us more about the future of the manufacturing and how it could impact a security company in Princeton. Now we're waiting on a pink. Pink cylinder, guys. On Tuesday, 20 students at Allegiance LCN are getting a better understanding on the impact the company has around the world. To get the understanding of manufacturing is one thing. I think that people are really, uh, really floored with what it is that we do here. Um, so for them to see that and get the hands-on experience really helps open their eyes. Allegiant produces door closers, shipping nearly thousands of them each day, a task that couldn't be done without a team. We currently have 257 employees that work here, um, full-time uh, employees. We do have some part-time uh, positions that we currently still have staffed. I need a blue, yellow, and a pink. According to the Bureau of Labor, over the next 10 years, there are 4 million manufacturing jobs that will be needed, but only half are expected to be filled. I think that uh, we are entering into the fourth industrial re revolution. I think we're seeing a dramatic evolution of automation and evolution of data uh, that requires new skill sets too. And I think, you know, the way that uh, we're able to talk to the students here um, is a way to upskill our labor. I think manufacturing here in the United States of America has a very bright future ahead of it. A bright future that begins here at a field trip where they hope some students will become interested in the industry. Recruiting um, all the time, we have skills that we require to fill positions here at LCN. In Princeton, Cesar Sanchez, WQAD News 8. Now, if you're interested in applying for a job at Allegiant, you can visit our website, wqad.com.